oh girl, let the mayhem begin. St. Patrick's Day and Spring Break are rolled up and won this weekend. So you know what that means? It is a good time to own a bar. I decided to check out Spring Break Mecca Fort Lauderdale at 2 in the morning to see how the party's going. Watch this. I am down here in Fort Lauderdale, Florida for spring break. And the good news is every college kid is getting a 4.0. The bad news is that's their blood alcohol content. It's a mess. Trump or Biden? Gosh darn, I don't have to answer that, man. It's so obvious. America knows it. America knows it. Trump or Biden? Trump. 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 Trump for the win. <laughs> and like, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, this guy, he wants to jump in now. The white dude. He didn't want to. Come here, white dude. Come on. Trump or Biden? Biden. Biden! You believe it? Come on, man. Biden's in bed right now. I'm joking. Trump for the win! The nice thing, I think, is that everyone here is sober. Yeah, you can say that. <laughs> <laughs> Who do you think, this is not about politics, okay. who do you think is better to party with on spring break, Trump or Biden? Oh, Trump, all the way. You think so, right? Yeah. Trump Dominic. likes trouble and I like trouble. Oh, oh my goodness gracious. Get this girl off the camera while her top is still on. My dog really living like that. Trump 2024. Make sure y'all vote for him. I ain't about to play. Look, Trump don't play no games with these people. He makes sure he gets done. We making America great again. Straight like that. Straight up. Trump 2024. North Dakota. Yep. What do you think of indoor plumbing so far? Um, I think it's pretty good for the economy. Hi. Oh, hey, girl. Look, she's just taking a picture. Oh, my God, I'm on TV. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Nice to see you. How are you? Trump or Biden or other? Other. Who's other, though? Who is other? My mother. Yo, her mother for president. I'm saying. It ain't Biden. He said he's voting for Jesse Waters. Take away his car keys. I'm a Democrat, so okay. I would go with Biden. I would go with Biden because just because my political opinions. But Trump, though? Do you think he, Biden he throws? But do you think he throws a good party? Oh, 100%. No. Trump would throw a better party. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. But hey. That was the question. No. It wasn't do you have an affinity for people with dementia. It was who throws a better oh, party. Oh, oh. So you're going to go. You're going to go Democrat Republican on me. No, you did that. No, you. The Phillies coming out. Trump. Yo, the dude said Trump all the way. Who do you think was on more drugs? The women of Fort Lauderdale or Biden at the State of the Union? That's a close one. That's a, wow. I might have to go with Biden there, honestly. Well, I hope you have a better shot with the women than you do with Biden. Hey, I appreciate Although that. Although I did hear he wears a leopard print diaper. Oh, also boy, from Texas. Friend. I'm her best friend. Yo. That's my best friend. We are in the white chicks are about to start crying and throwing up hour of spring break, by the way. I have a boyfriend. Trump or Biden? That's a Trump from the dog. Even the pets are going with DT. Rough night. Thankfully, Biden's not awake to see any of this. Trump. Yo, you heard that? 100%. So, yo, spring break is going for Trump. Yes. Which is weird because spring break party is like Hunter Biden. No. I mean, he drinks, he gets nuts. <laughs> this is my designated driver. I don't know if you guys have met before. Oh, everybody, oh right? Everybody thinks college kids are like liberal elite snobs. That was the opposite, and we didn't selectively edit that. Like we questioned like wow. probably a hundred people. Those were like the fifty who could speak English <laughs> because they were hammered. Oh okay, the one guy who said Biden was a Philly guy who wanted to fight me afterwards. Yeah. But they were bombed. Yeah. And what's funny is like if you know me as a comic, like. I don't care who they vote for. I don't want to be in charge of our democracy. I entered a profession where we get paid in chicken fingers yeah. the first five years. Chicken fingers, and if it goes well, Berg, we get moved up to the sandwich circuit, oh, no? Sandwich is so good. Those so, are the B clubs. And I, <laughs> I went out of my way to be like, this is not political. It's not who are you voting for. Yeah. They were, and I think that might be the Trump thing, like that was Murica. Like Fort Lauderdale is Murica. Exactly. It's I, why we have the Electoral College. That blonde girl. <laughs> that girl. She loved you. Oh, oh that gal? Yeah. She got she they was all, like in every shot. Tafoya, there's a lot of chubby chasers yeah. out there in the world. Do not, <laughs> don't act so surprised, Tafoya. She's like, oh my God, I can't believe that girl liked you. Yeah. Oh my she God, you're worse than her. Anyway. Really smart. She seemed really intelligent. She, yeah, she did. <laughs> Sober. Yeah. Well, let me move forward. She sadly, sadly, and this matters, between spring break and St. Patrick's Day, some folks are going to need to dry out for a little bit. One thing I noticed in my travels, I drove from Fort Lauderdale to Ponte Vedra, there's a lot of rehabs sound suspiciously like golf courses. 
which inspired this week's Saturday night game. It's called Golf Course or Rehab. And I'm going to read out the name of a fine establishment. The panel's going to guess if it's a golf course or a rehab. Either way, you might get to meet Tiger Woods. I mean, there's, there are perks to this game. You don't have to be right. Uh, we will start with you down the end, Katrina Campins. Golf course or rehab. Canyon Crossing in Prescott, Arizona. Is Canyon Crossing a golf course or a rehab? Golf course. You say golf course. You are incorrect. It is a oh, rehab. Oh, no way. Yes, pull it together. Oh. Games are very difficult. I don't really like Arizona, to be honest with you. Wow. They're there she was. She went wrong. By the way, <laughs> she got one question wrong and took a shot at an entire state. Yeah, I did that I don't like awesome. Arizona. <laughs> it looks like awesome. Mars. Yeah. I don't like it. Aaron Burke, here we go. I'm a bad person. Right. Mango Bay. <laughs> oh. Mango Bay in West Palm Beach, Florida. Is it a golf course or a rehab Mango Bay? I'm going to say because it's got, like, a, a food in it. It cannot be a rehab because people would think mango, then drink. So I'm going to go with golf course. And you are incorrect. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, wow. it is. Really? Bang. That I would have been with you on that yeah. one. So yeah. Foya. Yeah. Now that should have surprised you. Not a girl liking me. <laughs> <laughs> I am like mortally wounded. We're, we're supposed to be friends. I can't. Are you ready for this one? Yeah, I am. Hidden Hills in Jacksonville, Florida is Hidden Hills. A golf course or a rehab? I'm gonna say golf course. You're gonna say golf course. You are correct. Michelle yes. Foya. Listen, she's a Monday Night Football sideline reporter. She's going to have a little bit of an advantage here. But then at the same time, you probably know a lot of rehab folk, too. Uh, but moving forward, Campins, here you go. Get on the board. The Bridges. The Bridges in Bay, St. Louis, Mississippi. Rehab. The Bridges. You say rehab. Rehab. You are 0 for 2, boo. Wow. Now, I'm now really do not bad at blaspheme game. another state in wow. the process. No, take the L on this one. Aaron Berg, are you ready? I'll be classy sure. on that one. Back to Arizona. Silver Sands. Silver Sands. Rehab. You say rehab, and you are on the board, girl. Oh, thank oh. You. And that's good because you want to know something like we think of golf, sand trap. You yeah. don't want sands in the title, right? No. Because that's like kind of discouraging. Yeah, that's true. It's like if you had a, a strip club called the Crab. Yeah. You know what I mean? You, can, you know, not the best. All right, stick with me. Okay. Uh, two Rivers in Nashville, Tennessee. Is Two Rivers a golf course or a rehab? It's on the water. Uh, I'm going golf course. You are two for two, girl. Yes. Oh my God. Two for two. You're really good at this game. Uh, She's got game. She's got uh, game, uh, Campins. Let's see if you can get on the board. Man, yeah, Come no, on. I'm Every realtor figure. in Florida's reputation is riding on this guest. <laughs> this matters. Your whole state is a golf I know, course. it's true. The whole thing. It, it is. That's it amazing. Is. All right, here we go. Uh, we head out to California. Malibu Hills. In Malibu, California. Is Malibu Hills a golf course or a rehab? Rehab. You say it's a rehab, and you were on the board. Wow. She's a whole new woman. Cue the song from I the got, Jeffersons, Weezy. Katrina Campins. <laughs> All right, here we go, Berg. Twin Lakes. Twin Lakes in Monroe, Georgia. Monroe, Georgia. Regardless of what it is, I guarantee you it's within a mile of a Waffle House. Okay. Monroe, Georgia. Waffle House. Waffle House capital, though I love Waffle House. This is the waffle. hardest. You write the hardest games. This okay. is a golf course. You and say it's, it's a golf wrong, course. I'm gonna just yell. <laughs> <laughs> Aaron Berg is on the board. It is a golf course. Give it up for him. You have two now? So you see how she's stolen, by the way? She made small talk to <laughs> yeah, run yeah, some clock. That's going. a veteran sports reporter right there. Yeah. So let me get you have two, you have one. She knows she's in the lead. She knows what she did. Are we on a clock? Yeah. She just asked me. She's like, how's your wife and kid doing, Jay? Yeah. Classic Everything clock good? runner. Here we go. Carlton Oaks in Santee, California. Carlton Oaks. Oaks. Santee? California. I've never even heard of Santee, California. Ooh, I'm from California. You are. Well, it's a big state. All right. <laughs> Say it one more time. Carlton, Carlton Oaks. Oaks. I'm going rehab. You're going rehab. You are incorrect. Oh, damn. But oh. you have, in fact, won the game. I have? Yes. Michelle Tafoya will take home the yellow jacket as per the producers. Oh, my God. Now a two-time winner wow. of the yellow jacket, Michelle Tafoya. And Victor, our EP, says he's not just doing it because he hates your suede jacket. I'm kidding. It was great. We loved it. I owed you one cheap shot. Congrats. Give it up yeah, for Michelle did. Tafoya, yeah. everybody. You did it. Wow. How about it? I'm, I'm very proud. Two. Uh, the two for two on this show. Two for two. I've been two. here twice. I've won two yellow jackets. Uh -huh. This is like the biggest accomplishment of uh -huh. my year. No, it matters. But you earned it because you've clearly golfed enough that you probably need to go to rehab. I, <laughs> so take a bow. I'm drinking water. There's baby. our gal. Click here to subscribe to the Fox News YouTube page to catch our hottest interviews and most compelling analysis. You won't get it anywhere else.